All right, man, torture talk. Good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody. Good morning, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Good morning. All right, man, look, man. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I know, I know. Somebody said that I look like uh, Samuel Jackson, so I had to uh, switch it up. It looked like uh, Nino Brown or Malcolm X or somebody, but uh, excuse my wrinkled hat, you know what I'm saying? Uh, was at the bottom of my drawer so you see it it's all wrinkled but uh still fly though anyway uh yeah so today's episode i'm gonna be talking about drake um what's going on with him man you know what i'm saying i was thinking about that uh that picture he posted and um yeah there's a lot to that and i want to discuss that uh so yeah before i get into that you know i gotta get my spill this is torture talk if you like the content please consider subscribing good morning to y'all good morning to everybody out there you know what I'm saying I hope y'all having a good morning. Hope y'all woke up in good spirits. You know what I'm saying? Like, share, subscribe to the page. If you're new here, let me work for your subscription today. All the beautiful, sexy ladies put one in the chat. All the fellas. Y'all know where to find the ones at. Just don't harass them. I don't sell no merch, but I do have content that's absolutely free. But if you want to leave a donation, links on the screen. Cash at PayPal's in the description to help me buy a new hat. You know what I'm saying? Cause uh, yeah, that joint is wrinkled. Uh let me know where you're from too, man. I really appreciate that. Everybody telling me they're from. They called me the hidden gym. I went from 1,300 subscribers to over 11,000. I'm going to reach 12,000 real soon and a million by Monday morning. So look, all right, we're going to get right into this clip and uh, we'll be back to discuss. All right, man. So let's get to it. <laughs> Welcome back to Marcus at Work Media. So your boy Drizzy. BBL Drizzy makes it very, very easy for people to make fun of him because of the stuff he does. What am I talking about? Well, as of lately, your boy decided to show off his new hairstyle. We know if history has told us anything, he likes to be dramatic as possible with his hairstyle. Normally, this wouldn't even be something I even want to report on, but This is why Drake is in the position he's in, and I never could understand why. Well, then again, I can. When Kendrick said, you're 37, still showing up like a seven-year-old, this is this is exactly what this is. I think he fell into that. I think he fell into the whole model of when someone says something about you, do you do it even more, kind of like what Puffy did when uh, Suge was like, you don't want, you don't, if you don't want, uh, your record exec or your producer dancing in your videos coming to death row and then Diddy came out on stage dancing. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, this is what reminds me of Drake. Instead of him growing up and learning from people's mistakes that came before him, he does, he goes down the same path and it's not going to end well for him. I'm telling y'all now, mark my words. I don't wish nothing bad on anybody. But mark my words, this is not going to end well for him. Trust and believe that. But since it's Drake and it's so outlandish, let's get to it. Exhibit A here, we see your boy appears to be having some pigtails. You know, the classic slick back pigtail. Come on, man. 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 I don't know. Maybe, maybe this is his Halloween costume. Maybe he, maybe he's celebrating early or something. I don't know, but th this is this is outrageous. Listen, I don't have nothing against the 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 the, the, uh, the community. I should say the G community. I don't have nothing against y'all. Nothing at all. If y'all want to do what y'all want to do, fine. Don't have nothing against that. But. This is a mockery of, of uh, women. You know what I'm saying? Let's be clear here. This is a little girl's hairstyle. I don't care what nobody says. This is a little girl's hairstyle. And I understand that some, guy, some dudes who do this, they have pig, pigtails. They do. They do. But the, but the reason why I say there's a big re difference between theirs and his. The reason why I say this is a little girl hairstyle is because of those right there. That's why. 
this is exactly why I say this is a little girl hairstyle. Dope. So it feeds right into the narrative of him liking younger women. You know what I'm saying? And liking little girls. Now, people may say, well, that's a reach or whatever, but it's not a reach. Would you want this man to be around your daughter? This man right here, would you want him to be around your daughter? If you seen this picture and you didn't know Drake, you would you would definitely think that he was homosexual. I'm just being honest. You would definitely think he was homosexual. Ain't nothing wrong with being homosexual if that's what you are, because you are. I'm not. But if that's what you are, that's what you are. But you would definitely think that. So I just don't know what to say anymore because this type of behavior, it just shows, it just lets me know that he really took a major L. He took a major L. And I just don't think he's going to ever recover from this. I don't. I really don't. I don't. And I don't, I, we'll, we'll get to that. We'll get to more of it. Let's go. With, with the ends there, got the little Brett action going. I mean, this is pretty tame for Drake. No! No! Nigga. How did that make you feel reacting that way? I felt decent because we know what his other hairstyles were like before, but he got roasted on social media. Of course, it's like he wants the attention no matter how he gets it. Who else does stuff like that? Girls, some women, just crave the Listen, man, everything, everything that Kendrick Lamar has said about Drake is coming true. Everything. Everything he has said. Everything. It's unreal how this guy is reacting. And maybe, maybe, you know what? Maybe he was doing this before the battle. Maybe he was. Maybe people just didn't highlight it or really wasn't paying attention to it. But at this point now, it's like, You've been failing for the last four to five months. And the only reason why you stay in afloat is because, is because you, only reason why you stay in afloat is because you are such a big star. Outside of that, if this was anybody else, you'd be, you'll be out of here. You'll be gone. You, they, would, they would say, nah, bro, we can't, we can't have that. You'll be out of here. But it's you. And this is the reason why. So I don't know what to say, man. Let's go tension by any means is possible don't don't get me wrong that's not every woman or every girl i mean but it is a feminine characteristic is what i'm trying to say and your boy nails it every single time i wake up in the morning i'm trying to get my thoughts together and here's drake looking like an around the way girl why do you look like a high school basketball player's groupie girlfriend? Why are you dressed like this? Why? Do you have barrettes in your head and a part? Who are you? I, I don't this is this is disgusting. I'm not even gonna lie to you. It's disgusting because you're 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 uh you're portraying to be this moral, not even moral, but you're portraying to be a man. Who uh, who is a uh, uh, Casanova and and what's the name? I'm be honest with y'all. This dude is undercover, straight up. And I just and people need to understand he's gonna come out the closet sooner or later. I'm telling you because this right here it just displays that. And again, if he comes out and 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 happy happy joy joy, that's fine. He could do that. It's no problem with it. Nobody's gonna say anything. Whatever. People probably celebrate it. I won't, but people will probably celebrate it. You know what I'm saying? It's all good if he does that, but at least be honest about it. You know what I'm saying? At least be honest about it. But then again, you know what? You know what? Maybe, maybe it's best that he doesn't say anything. Maybe he's be it's best that, that he keeps it to himself. Maybe it's best he does this. Maybe, maybe. I understand. You look like a prison dude's boyfriend. I don't understand. <laughs> Um, I said, why do you keep doing this? Why? And why? Yo. <laughs> the, duck, the duck lips is legendary. 
<laughs> At this point, just keep going with the duck lips. I mean, it's just, it's a part of Drake. <laughs> um, this is annoying. You look like you want to pop ass with him. Kendrick was right. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God. IG baddie Drake. What are we going to do with you? This messes up the sound of your music. Okay. <laughs> You can't rap about. <laughs> yeah, that that is a hundred percent facts. It actually does messes up the sound of his music because now <clears throat> you can't rap about being this guy who's sleeping with all these girls because you are showing up like a girl now, and it's just it just sounds weird. You just sound weird now. You know what I'm saying? And I know a lot of you people gonna be out there defending it. I don't understand how a real upstanding man could defend something like this. I don't understand it, but. Then again, you got some people out there who will make, he'll do anything for Drake. They, they literally are cheerleaders and groupies and don't even understand that that's what they are. It's crazy to me. Crazy. No more thug-ish. No more OVO gangsters. Okay, because you have this picture right here. Unless this was how you did it the whole time. There are some like feminine gangsters like Busy Bone. But you are not Busy Bone. Okay, it's too late. We know your whole story already. Now let's dig into the crates a little bit to look at some of the other outlandish hairstyles he's put up. We got this one. This is a favorite, you know, with the little barrettes across the tops. We got the little, little hair clips across the top. Come on, bro. I just don't understand what he's doing with that. I don't. And, you know, we got fans making fun of it, all of that. I mean, my guy is beyond a midlife crisis at this point. I have no idea what this is, but I don't understand. And, and the more critical question, if I want to play devil's advocate here, who does this appeal to? What demographic of people would this appeal to? You guessed it, little girls. Kids would get a kick out of this because adults, we don't really show off like that. Now to be just funny or a costume or a cosplay or something like that, maybe you can get some of these uh, outlandish styles and costumes, but this is, this is an everyday situation for Drake. And he does this to create some buzz in the news and get his name out there. Like, come on, man. Come on, man. This is an everyday situation for Drake, and he does this to create some buzz in the news. Look at this shit. This is crazy work here, man. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. It's crazy. Like, I don't, I don't get it. But let's keep it going. And get his name out there, but does it land the way you want it to? Is this the kind of publicity you want, Drake? Because after the beef, after everything fell out, you're still trying to get your footing back with your fan base. You're still trying to get the music back going. You're already trending down with some of that. You want to throw this in the mix? And also, let's not forget, it's all the other allegations dealing with the minors that's still in the background there that people ain't forgot about and you continue doing stuff like this i just and that's and that's exactly what i'm saying all of these things are still looming around drake's head and yet and still he's still out here doing things that make it seem like he's he is compromised on that position it's so crazy to me how he would post a picture like that knowing that people already believe that he deals with little girls you know what i'm saying i don't understand it but yet and still he's out here still doing this for attention instead of dropping music and dropping good music you would rather post a picture with your duck lips or you'd rather post a picture with ponytails or you'd rather post a picture with a barrettes or clips in your hair instead of you doing good music that's the problem with Drake. He doesn't do any more good music. He just constantly does things for attention. And it's like, okay, we get it. You are, you're known. You're the biggest, one of the biggest stars in the world. You're known. But you're just making yourself look even worse. You know what I'm saying? It, and I don't even know how to even say even worse because worse is just worse. You know what I'm saying? It, it, either you're worse and you're worse and you're getting worse, sir. And there's no one if there's such thing as worse, sir. 
but you're making yourself look super bad. You know what I'm saying? And it's crazy. It's crazy. Don't understand it. If you guys can help me out, put your comments below and let's talk about it. But I just, I just having a hard time wrapping my mind around why this would be a good idea. Yeah, all right, man. So the links will be in the description. Make sure y'all go follow that, man. Like, just lets me know that everything that Kendrick's been saying about Drake is absolutely true. You know what I'm saying? Look at look at how he's moving out here. Some of these things he's he he is he is portraying. It's like, as a man, you shouldn't be doing some of these things. You know what I'm saying? And I think that you gotta understand what position this man is in right now. And I hate to use the word position. But you got to understand the position he's in. He's been checkmated, and now he's kind of looking for attention any way he can because he believes in his head that any attention is good attention, and it's actually not. He wants to be, what they say, famous. He wants to be infamous. And right now, whatever he's doing, however it's going for him, it's just not working. For me, I'm looking at it like, why is Drake, every time I turn around, why isn't he releasing music? I'm talking like new songs, good music, or trying to get back to where he was when he was uh ten about ten years ago when he was doing actual good material whether he had people writing for him or not, but at this point he just don't do anything that is something that I could say is actually significant enough to say that he is close to Kendrick. Kendrick has lapped him and Cole. These dudes are not even close to this dude anymore. They're not close to Kendrick anymore. He came in, he snatched the crown, he took it from him, and that was it. So all I got to say is, y'all, have a good afternoon. <laughs> man, man, good morning, actually. And, um, yeah, I'll talk to y'all at 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock show coming up. You know what it is. All right, man. See y'all. Peace. Bye. <laughs>